And turning to the presidential campaign, DPP presidential candidate Tsai Ing-wen released a documentary film about her journey through various Hakka villages hoping to garner Hakka votes. Meanwhile, her KMT opponent Eric Chu announced his education policy. Chu focused on increasing education budgets and enhancing education on seniors and disadvantaged children. DPP presidential candidate Tsai Ing-wen narrates a documentary film in the Hakka language about her travels along Provincial Highway No. 3, which is known to be populated by the Hakka community. 90-year-old Taiwanese writer Zhong Zhaozhen, who is of Hakka descent, was very agitated after watching a clip at the press conference. Hakka people will disappear if the Hakka dialect dies. I hope Mr. Zhang will at least be happier when he reaches 100, because maybe then he could experience the revival of Hakka culture. While DPP presidential candidate vows to promote the Hakka language, KMT's presidential candidate Eric Zhu announced his education policy. The KMT policy is to raise the current education budget from 22.5 to 23.5 percent of the nation's overall budget. Besides raising education funds, Zhu also hopes to promote lifelong education for seniors and increase financial support for the education of disadvantaged children.